What is up, everybody? Standing Ovation here again with another break. And this one is a little overdue, as I missed release date uh, last week uh, on release day of, of Upper Deck Extended. So here it is now. I got a box, a hobby box of 2223 Upper Deck Series 3 or Extended Series, if you want to call it. I, and I wasn't terribly upset that I missed it, as the price point for this product I don't think should be the same as uh the other two products i don't know maybe because they put all the extra inserts in there series one and series two have 50 young guns this only has 30 young guns and the young guns crop is kind of like a bunch of owls who 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 and yeah but there's you know the marchenko is it marchenko i don't know the guy on uh columbus is all right i guess and then you got your uh, box boy here from the Red Wings, but I don't know. The Red Wings have had so many rookies lately that everybody jumped on board, and then they're like, watch their cards deflate in value. But, you know, that's kind of what the hobby does sometimes. Unless the team succeeds, those values don't always stay up there. Okay, well, and then I guess Cole Caulfield would kind of disprove that point. Let's see what happens in this box. And thanks for watching to everybody who's tuned in. Thank you for tuning in. Everybody who's subscribed, thanks for subscribing. Please, if you haven't already, tap the like button, subscribe. You got here the best time because I'm almost at 1,000 subscribers. When I get to 1,000, I'm going to do a free giveaway. And if you're watching this and you're only waiting for the free giveaway because this is the night that I do the giveaway, I got 16 packs that I'm giving away at midnight. And that's going to happen at the end of this video. But um, at any rate, let's break this first and... Uh, We'll get to see who wins those packs afterwards. Anyway, let's see what we can do with that. Let's rip open a hobby box of Upper Deck Extended. Again, 24 packs. Probably if you've watched videos before, you've seen this stuff get ripped. Because as I say, I missed the lease date. Unfortunately, there's forest fires in my region that closed the highway down. And it is supposed to be open this weekend. But I don't know. Maybe maybe it won't be. We'll see how long it stays open. And then they're only going to open it in one direction for part of the day and the other direction in the other part of the day. But... That's the price you pay for island life. I live in the west west coast of the west part of Canada, and there's really only about 30,000 people in the whole area around here. So when the highway shut down, the government was like, yeah, whatever, well, we'll get there. There's back roads, you can get around. And let me tell you, if I ever get it to it, the, the back roads video that I'll show on the distance and the, and the method I got to the, go to the store to get these, I, it'd be worth a watch. But then again, it's a four hour video that I'd somehow have to compile it on my dash cams and it may just not be worth the effort because it's kind of a, well, it's a very scenic drive, but uh, holy cow. Anyway, that's that's neither here nor there. Let's rip some packs and see what we get. Make the, uh, if you're looking at it as an investment. But again, as I always say, clock cards are always an investment, but the price they charge for this was 150 bucks Canadian, which may be a little cheaper, a little more depending on where you are. Zaka. Protoss, Delorier, first pack. I got an E2 Makinami, Young Guns, Ryan Murray, Calvin DeHaan, Jason Zucker, and Gabe Lardy. Goalies, I mean, really, you think about it, there's 32 jobs for goalies in the league, plus the backup, 64 goalies, plus the guy that they'll call up. So, really, you think of all the jobs in the world to get. It's, it's a tough one. And hold that job is the even harder. Okay, anyway, here we go. Huberto. With the Calgary Flames, Brendan Smith. Free agent signings have just begun and trades and all that. I hear the Habs are looking at trading to get uh, um, Fantilli, but I don't know if that's happened yet or if that's just a rumor. Antti Ranta, Rasmus Sandin. Of course, he hasn't been drafted as I'm speaking right now. Here's the first Young Guns retro hit is going to be. Who is it? It's a Tampa Bay Lightning. I can barely read it. Holy cow, you can't hardly see the name on the front. I should recognize it's... Uh, no, I don't, though. Who the heck is this guy? Nick Prebix. I never even saw Young Guns of him in the Series 1 or 2. And there's a retro Young Guns. So is he in the Extended Series, or is he just one of the Series 2 guys I haven't got yet? I'm still building a Series 2 set. I think I need about 12 Young Guns. Wedgwood, Clayton Keller All-Star. Derek Ryan. So what's happening with Arizona in the offseason? I don't know. Same problem as usual. They should just move to Houston, make it easier. Even better, move to Hamilton or Quebec. Make a bunch of Canadians happy. Yeah, like Batman would never let that happen. Bjogstad. Burkowski. Justin Hall. Now here's one of these three-part new inserts. The three parts of, of uh, you know, what's... Ing Inkton Capitals. It's the Inktop, Ink Inkton Capitals Eight Wing. 
CaO3. There's C Cm AO1 and AO2, and there's the picture of the whole card all together. I like the idea, but yeah, I don't know if any if they they should have made one version really hard to get. Maybe they did. I don't know. McDavid All Star. That's a cool card. Suzuki All Star. That's not as cool a card. Gustafson and Romanoff. Romanoff with the Islanders. There he is. Just uh, used to seeing him with all the Habs rookie cards. And here he is with the Islanders. Didn't he go to St. Louis first, though? What happened there? No, he just went to the Islanders. I don't know why I thought he went to St. Louis. Johnny Gibson, all star card. UC Saros, all star card. Andre Platt. Chris Kreider, all star card. Uh, there's one of these new smooth grooves. Robert Thomas. Now that's kind of a cool card. I don't know, is that the acetate version? I don't have anything to compare it to. It is kind of, that's an acetate or a plastic or what do you want to call it? Ben Hutton. Christian Jerry All-Star. And Vincent Trochak. Okay, yeah. And upon further inspection, it's definitely an acetate card. I think that's, there's two versions of it. The non-acetate and the acetate. But maybe I'm wrong and I quite likely am. Okay. Troy Stetcher. Stam Steel. Stam Steel. And Sam Steel. Logan O'Connor. There's one of my first SPs. The first overall picks of Simon Holmstrom. And I don't remember what pick he was overall. 23rd overall in the 2019 draft. Dadnoff, Vili Husso, Kelly McCarr all start. They wouldn't have done that. Everly. Okay, Vili Husso. Didn't know he was the backup. Or if I did, I forgot. I think I got his future watch somewhere. Hmm. I'll have to check that out too. If you like ripping cards and you like watching this and I'm not too annoying, or even if I am, help me out, grow the channel, tap the like button, subscribe, help me get to a thousand subscribers, and if I've done it already, because I'm getting close, and I don't know what chances are, I've got months to go, but I, as I creep towards it, I'm just like, help me get there, and once I'm there, then help me get to 2,000, and whatever, let's just grow this channel till it can't grow anymore. Petrie, Kairu, Klingberg, Bird? No, it's Klingberg. Dylan Lark and D-Boss, all-star card. Here's, oh, cool. First Young Guns canvas hit. Tyler Tucker. These seem to be easier to hit. For some reason, the Young Guns canvases seem to pop out more readily in the extended, I've noticed. Um, yeah. Maroon, Matthews, all-star. And Nicholas Mlosh. Where's that Matthews all-star card? Oh, they just put regular season stats on there. Cool. So, is this, there we go. Okay. I got a Young Guns canvas and a regular Young Guns and a retro Young Guns. All kinds of Young Guns. However, none of them are really that good. Womp womp. Travis Dermott. Hemo Meyer. Now that's kind of a sneaky little grimace thing he's got going on there. Hemo Meyer All Star. Brock McGinn. And all that pink going on behind Freddie Anderson. Hmm. There's a regular canvas of Team Wire. Style in the Shades. It's like one of those uh, street clothes versions or, or photo variants, but it's just a canvas card. Canvas is always a good set. Kuznetsov, All Star. Huberto, All Star. And Kelly Yarn Rock of the Toronto Maple Leafs. Fourth liner that went to the third line. He could be on the starting line soon, the way they played. I don't know. I got to do lots to fix that team. Maybe he's already gone. Like, I don't know what happens in the next couple of weeks. So the, all the teams going to make changes. Stanley Cup winning Alex Petrangelo, also an all-star. That's cool. Congrats to the Golden Knights. First ever Stanley Cup. Here's David Riddich from the Where Are You Now Files. Thomas Grease, St. Louis Blues Retro. I like the jersey there. There's El, Elmer Soderblom, single diamond. 0607 design of Black Diamond. There's all kinds of these in parallels you can hit. Autograph versions numbered at a 10, too, I think. Adam Boquist, Sprong, Stahl, and Campbell. Nice goalie mask shot. 
22-23 season, he was with the Oilers, not the Maple Leafs. 21-22, he was with the Maple Leafs. You'd think he'd extended the put no. He just left him with the Leafs as an all-star. All right. Matthias Samuelson. Alex Dabrinkit, all-star. Tom Wilson, all-star. Edmund, all-star. Elias Peterson. 0708 Design Retro Tribute. <coughs> Pardon me. Luke Shen. Kempe and Chad Rudwell. All right. Well, again, this box is carrying along. Again, I don't see how $150 value is justified just yet, but let's see. Carry on. Don't give up hope. Matt Murray. Kubelik. Shalby. Johnson. Fallaby. I can't remember how you said. Oh, cool. Nico Heischer. High gloss. Again, it seems like the inserts are a little easier to pull in the retro, which leads me to believe that there's probably less of this product made, which is perhaps why they justified the higher price. But I don't know. That's uh, that's a nice hit. Numbered at a 10, Nico Heischer. And it's got a Young Guns right behind it of Pontus. No, it isn't. It's Pontus. It's Simeon der Argachunstev. I, I, I can't remember if that's how you say it. Der Argen, Argachunstev. Something like that. That's one of the hardest names ever. It's a total hockey player's name for sure. But let's just, well, let's get rid of my base here. Talbot, Achari, and Tachuk, Matty Tachuk with the Panthers. Here's a cool card. A little ding corner already though. Why? Or is that just white? I hate it when they do that with these photography. Sometimes you get a white in the corner, but I think a little white spot on there. I don't know. I'll have to find another base to compare it to. Yeah. Okay, let's go back to this. Well, there's the young guns. Yeah, some guy. Nico Heischer, T41, high gloss, parallel. Number eight of ten. Of all my penny sleeves. And then I actually had to say, I had to restock on them. And here we go. Okay, do I have to cut it to get it in there? Hopefully not. These are good ones. These are the premium penny sleeves. The high-end ones. They're like a penny and a half. Cool. All right, let's move along. Or the days over. Lots of things to do. Can't be watching videos all day. Wait a minute, I'm making the video. You guys are the watching ones. Hopefully you're not just skipping ahead. Hopefully you're even watching still. Okay, Intel Strawman, Kadri, and Goudreau checklist. Oh, we got something really shiny coming up. The All-Star, Jack Hughes, Marino, Sturm, Valeno, Stompy Valeno, and nothing to see you. Nothing to see here. Wait a minute. We got Jack Hughes hiding. Why Johnson's history collection? This is like a 2000 or 1999 2000 upper deck styled card. Very shiny. They weren't this shiny back then. Yeah, good luck to everybody in the draw if you're uh, going in and we're trying to win some packs. 16 packs. I mean, they're good ones in here. I've got some 0607. You might pull a Malkin. A Pavelski Young Guns, you could fit. I mean, I know they're a long shot. There's some hobby packs in there. There's a couple of retail packs, too. Different years. Anyway, let's go back to this current, brand new year of Upper Deck Series 3, I call it. But it's extended. Sizikas. Hey, there he is. My man. Not far from here is where he lived, or lives. Or I don't know if he's still from there or not. But Comox, Courtney, which is about, I don't know. An hour's drive away from here. I've been to Colossal Sports Cards a couple times up there in Courtney. Colmox, good store. I guess they're on Colmox Road in Courtney. I don't know if that makes sense, but it's like one of those cities that have two names. There's like a ha there's the cities that join each other. And the other goalie that got injured, Laurent Brassois. I mean, they have like 47 goalies on the Golden Knights, but um, Laurent Brassois is from right here in town. Right? And the first time ever, somebody from Port Alberni, born from in Port Alberni, has won Stanley Cup, but... That's not him. That's it. This is Aiden Hill. And I don't know how many people from Colmox have won a cup, but there you go. Congrats to the Golden Knights again. Again, Max Domi, Ben Sherratt. Okay, here's a die cut Ovechkin SPX 9798 design. SPX 20. This is just like the regular modern parallel version. Kind of a cool card. Again, they weren't that flashy in 9798. There's two Ovechkins in this box. It's kind of cool. The Brinket. Kulikov and Mackenzie Weger. Halfway through the box, it's been pretty good. Again, not with the young guns, but the extra stuff coming out of it. I guess maybe that's what I've heard from some people. They're relatively happy with what they ripped just from what came out of the box. It's usually the young guns you want, right? There's a big one that you want to get. 
Glenn Denning, Kaprizov All-Star, Brett Gulak, Dreisaitl All-Star, Canvas of Cad, Kadri. The Leafs should have never let him go. That's my opinion. What do I know? Mark Nook, Lilligren, and Cassian. Namestikoff, Mark Stahl, Fabian Zetterlin. Here's another one in Black Diamond things. 0607 design of Pastaman, Pasternak, David Perron, Sam Gagne, David Kredge, and a checklist with Matty to Chuck on it. Sveshnikov, the Evgeny style. Jack Campbell, see? There he is, the Oilers. Maple Leafs and the All-Stars, apparently. I guess they're, they're repping the last year's All-Star game when he was still a Leaf, so I'm just being overly critical for no good reason. Colin Blackwell. Another goalie card of Cam Talbot. Here's Kareel, the retro design. T34, 0708, retro. Sebastian Aho, Wallstrom, and Phil. Third Stanley Cup. Put his baby in that cup there. That was a cool little picture. Ryan Strom, Kadri, Goudreau All-Star. Oh, Dylan Holloway. Oops, I'm throwing the base around. Here's one of them SPs again. They're kind of like the same odds. Well, they are the same odds as hitting a young gun. It's Dylan Holloway. Fine young player for Oilers. So you sound like a real old man. Oh, what a fun young man that fella is. You know, I, when I was young, we had to walk to school uphill both directions. Oh. Razik. Mata. Ryan Carpenter. I haven't seen a lot of cards of him in Upper Decks lineup. There's Nick Foligno. I just chucked him aside like he's not even worth anything. It's a cool Boston jersey. But Ryan Carpenter, like, where the heck have you been hiding? Oh, 308 games played, and I don't remember seeing any of your cards before, but whatever. Lindblom, Lindblom, Lindblom. Dylan Strom, All-Star, was there a French card in here? Maybe, because it looks like something's... Oh, no, there's an Acetate, Dreisaitl, nice one there. All-Star Acetate, card 690 of Neon Leon. Very cool card. You can see through it. And I got... Drew, as the Senators, that's cool. Dakota Joshua, and we got like maybe little six packs here. Teddy Goudreau's a Columbus Blue Jackets. Rodriguez, Golagoski. Okay, Jack Hughes, second exclusive in a box. First one's he sure, second one's Hughes. It's a very Devils friendly box. Fifty one of one hundred. Jack Hughes All Star. Nice, nice, nice hit. Let me just, again, before I put it down and pick it up, pick it up and put it down. Pick things up and put them down. Slip it in there. Sweet. I like getting good cards. Brett Burns, the bushy beard. Sean Monahan. Leah McCav. Still got a few young guns of him left as a Canuck. Mason Shaw. Maxime Comtois. Eric Brandstrom. Colton Sissons. Niels Lundqvist. There's a canvas. Riley Smith. Congrats to Riley with... Is he one of the misfits? I think he's one of the misfits. Vitaly Kravstov. Kravstov? I don't know. He's back in Russia. Whatever. Justin Schultz with a big fish in his... What the heck's going on there? Justin Braun, but you don't have a fish in your hand. Why is he carrying a fish? I know they're the Kraken, but... That's kind of just over. Brady to Chuck, Bergeron All Star, Zach Paris, Young Guns. Right on. I'm glad I got one of the guys. Jonathan Bergeron. Not Jonathan. Jonathan Bergeron. Bjorkstrand. Zach Aston Reese, Troy Terry, and Joe Pavelski. Right. We got Darcy Kemper, Claude Giroux, Darcy Halak, Michael Matheson, Maddie to Chuck. That might be a popular card up to. Try putting that up for auction. I can't believe somebody still, the price they paid for like uh, that Vanacek. Jake Gensel and Josh Brown. I auctioned off just a base card, a trilogy of Matty to Chuck because I got it on release day. It was him in a Panthers jersey. And just a base card of Matty to Chuck went for over, well, I shouldn't tell, but it was over $25 US that somebody paid for the base card. It was an auction. So I guess two people really, really wanted it. And still, again, when you think about how much 
trilogy you have to rip to actually hit all the base cards. Just the base cards shouldn't be dissed on so easily because trilogy is a fairly thin product, six packs and mostly inserts. Base cards are actually kind of rare until they come out with a retail product, which they probably will. Roman Yossi, Andrew Kopp, Marcia So, man of the hour, and there's Atu Rati. That's a good dazzler to get, one of the new up and comers. 129. There's actually 700 dazzlers in the set this year. No, there's not true at all. Philip Gustafson, the Gus Bus. There he is as a Minnesota Wild. John Manson, Jan Ruta, and Cal Connor. By the time I do the draw at the end of this, this will be another one of them half hour videos showing me, reminding me that I need, I need to work on making these a little bit more brief. Samson off, Stamkos, Sador off, Marshman. There's the French variant, French Phil. He's a French Phil. En Francais, his name is still Phil. Okay, I'll just put that there. Petrano, Rasmus Dahlin, and Mark Stone. Congrats to Mark Stone. All right, last pack. Thanks for watching this break and all my other ones. Tune in for another one if you're completely bored, but it's always fun. All right, here we go. Philip Grubauer, Mar Mahura, Josh Mahura, Andre Vasilevsky, All Star, Young Guns, Pontus Holmberg, Marcus Johansson, Morgan Geeky, Ilya Lubushkin, and Nazem Kadri. Okay, and there's 20 of the first round picks. Okay, I get it. There's my retros. I got the one there of, uh, I already forgot, Nick Prebex, Kaprizov, Peterson, and Penny Sleeved, Matty Tachuk. Two of the newer inserts, and they're both Ovechkin, so that's not a bad thing. Hobby only hits. I got French variant Phil. I got a clear cut Leon. I don't think, I don't know if that's hobby only, but the smooth groove is kind of an acetate card, and I don't think these are hobby only either. But it's a history class. Y. Johnson, rookie, second up, runner up to the rookie of the year is my prediction. Veneers will take that one home, but the two big hits, high gloss Heischer, and an exclusive. Jack Hughes, Free Smith, nice. Kadri, Timo Meyer, and Tyler Tucker, Young Guns Canvas. So we'll see if I do that again. Oh, I forgot the Black Diamonds. Pasternak and the Solder Blom. Good old ratty. But I might. So stay tuned, stay watching. Keep on collecting, folks. And again, good luck on the 16 packs that just might get won by you if you've subscribed, liked, and commented more hockey in the appropriate video. Stay tuned. I'll be giving them away in just a sec. All right. There they are. 16 packs all waiting to be ripped open by the lucky winner who uh, hopefully has publicly subscribed. I got to tell you, if people aren't publicly subscribed, I cannot pick the winner. And I'll tell you, I only say that because I, I have done this draw once already. And the winner I picked, I won't name who it was, but they weren't publicly subscribed. So the settings got to be on public for you actually, because there's no way I can tell if you're actually subscribed. That's the only reason I, I need to be able to verify you are a subscriber. Okay, then let's do this with 74 comments. I counted this because as I say, I hate to say I, this is the second time I've had to do the draw because the first winner didn't publicly subscribe. Anyway, let's go. Good luck to everybody. And again, thanks to everybody who's, who has subscribed, whether you're publicly subscribed or not. I, I, so I appreciate everybody who's joining the channel. Um, but again, to win, you got to be publicly subscribed. Okay, let's do this. Let's do this. Random comment picker. Again, I don't know where are we going here. On YouTube. Okay. And let's drop that link in there. Paste. And let's get those comments. 74. See, there they are. Okay. Now, I got a hashtag, more hockey. And right now, we need more hockey because the season's over. Stanley Cup champs for the Golden Knights. Holy cow. Congrats to them. More hockey. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Good luck to everybody in the draw. The name will be selected at random. And it is Shea Weber, 35. Love the variety. Hashtag more hockey. Okay, well, Jay Weber, 35, you got to the Sunday night at midnight to get a hold of me. Put that link, what link? It's not a link. Copy and paste the email address there and send me a message where you're at so I can send you these cards. And good luck when you open them, if you open them. Or maybe you're going to just 
cherish them forever, sealed packs. I wouldn't. I'd rip them. I'm, I'm tempted to rip them now. No, I'm, I won't. Okay, thanks, everybody. Keep on collecting. And keep watching the channel for the 1,000 subscriber giveaway. It's almost here. I can't believe it. I'm almost there. Like 60 more people, I think. As soon as I hit that mark, I'll launch the video. Okay, good luck in that one, if you're in that too. Keep on collecting. Standing ovation out.